Disclaimer. The subject matter has been produced using AI technology and can in no way be employed as fact. The AI works on articles and blogs, so it may only be deemed as what others believe, not necessarily the editor of this video. This video is in no way intended as fact or intended to cause undue stress, only for entertainment value. The disclaimer is produced by Tony of Tony's Music. Thank you. In a word, influence. That's what money and politics buys. When it comes to campaign donations, the candidate with the most money usually wins. That's because they can afford to buy more advertising, hire more staff, and generally run a more professional campaign. And when it comes to lobbying, well, money talks. Politicians are more likely to listen to a lobbyist representing a big corporation or special interest group than they are to listen to their own constituent. That's because lobbyists have deep pockets and can afford to make generous campaign donations. So what does all this money buy? Influence. Plain and simple. And that's not a good thing for democracy. When money is allowed to buy influence. It means that the wealthy have more say in our government than the average citizen. That's not how democracy is supposed to work. There are some steps being taken to reduce the influence of money in politics, but more needs to be done. Until then, we'll just have to keep a close eye on our politicians and make sure they're not being bought and sold by the highest bidder. The end.